Konbama. So in a recent video, I was reading this article about a blue plasma flash relating to a CORONA discharge. And then Miss Marfugel at M. Marfugel retweeted this about lightning. And there's this clip with this weird sound like that goes with the lightning it's like it sounds like uh well let me know what you think it sounds like we'll also take a look at an article about a blue ethereal world flame so here's the clip it's kind of loud so it's kind of like a beep sound and then you can see like this, the flash, like, above the hood. So it's kind of interesting, and the, it was like the, it looked orange, like the light. Okay, so here's the article, Mysterious Blue Whirl Flame. It says a recently discovered soot-free flame called a blue whirl actually consists of three different flame structures that swirl together into one quote otherworldly blue ring according to the first study to identify how these unique flames form by revealing the blue world structure the findings may inform potential applications of the flame for efficient low transmission combustion quote only if we understand its structure can we tame it scale it and create it at will Joseph Chung and colleagues write in the study. Scientists recently discovered the formation of a blue whirl while experimenting with fire whirls produced by burning liquid hydrocarbon fuels on a water base. But further investigations have since produced temperature maps of blue whirls and informed how they can be stabilized, their flame structure and dynamics. Especially how they form from a fire whirl have remained mysterious. To simulate how blue whirls emerge, Chung et al. coupled 3D time-dependent equations that describe the motion of viscous fluid substances to a model for fuel conversion and chemical energy release. The researchers started by simulating experimental conditions, then tweaked physical parameters such as fuel and air size and velocity in their calculations until a blue whirl materialized. The researchers found that the ethereal flame is composed of three different flames, a diffusion flame in which the fuel and oxidizer are separated before burning, and premixed rich and lean flames. Chung et al. conclude that their research provides a tool to further explore this phenomenon, including whether the flame can be made directly and scaled up safely for larger size to larger sizes. So it seems like all of this could possibly relate to the Earth's magnetic field. Okay, thanks for watching. Arigato, matane.